So the Cus-V is the common unmanned surface vehicle that's currently being used by the Navy in a mine countermine mission. It's done in LCS. What it would be used for is an anti-terrorism force protection mission to help protect uh, ports and harbors and high value assets. I think there's a tremendous potential use for the unmanned surface uh, vessel, just like aerial or subsurface, and you know what those tools can do for our Navy security force that protects and provides a safety blanket over all of our installations. And I think it's a tremendous tool that can potentially operate in environments where manned uh, assets would be at risk, and it's all designed to have the most effective force and tool for our Navy security forces to protect our installations. So the potential use uh, for the CUSPI as a ATFP tool is it helps us with minimal manning so it, there's nobody in the boat and you can control it easily by yourself or from the tower. It's also able to push the threat out beyond where the harbor patrol boats normally operate. So it gives us a, a force multiplying effect. So what we've done here with this uh, version is a prototype that does ATFP. We've added payloads that enable it to do things like um, go out and query a threat vessel with a hailer, a non-lethal weapon package. And also backed up by a lethal weapon package in case when we tell it to turn away with our hailer, it doesn't, then we can engage it with the gun. We have humans on the loop that control it uh, from a ground control station with regard to monitoring the systems that actually pick up threat targets and detection. So it can operate autonomously while in the water. The United States Navy as a whole obviously has a large contributing piece to the defense of our nation. Then we have a large waterfront that needs protected, just like the fence lines that you see on land that are around us and the entry control points or the gates that we come through. We've got to protect the waterfront side of it. 